What? The biggest Android security update has been out and running for the past three months and most Android users are not even aware of that. Yes, right now, the new Google Find My device network can track Android phones that are turned off using Bluetooth Beacon. Now, this ability has been on iPhone since iPhone 11, and I'm so excited it's on Android, but yet it's out, it's been rolling out on many countries. Now, I have that ability from my Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra, even in Nigeria, but many people are not aware of that. Okay, so let me clear the confusion and explain to you three or four major things you need to know about this new uh, Find My Network. Starting from Android 15, every device that comes out of Android 15 out of the box will have the capacity to be tracked offline. It's one of the special system stuff that Android 15 is bringing. But even before that, they will use the new Find My Google network. And if you're using Android device that is up to Android 9 and above, you can opt in into the new Find My network. And this is how it works. When it comes to tracking devices that are offline, there has to be a hardware component to it and OEM decision to add that. So for Google, Pixel 8 and Pixel 8 Pro have the capacity to be tracked even when they are offline. Uh, I made a full video about this on YouTube. So if you want to watch the whole long video, you can go to YouTube and see that. So, but what does that mean? The device makers can now add some features inside the phone that will make it to be tracked even if it is turned off. For Google Pixel 8 Pro, it can be tracked even when it has run out of battery or when the phone is turned off. Yes, it can be tracked with that new Google uh, Find My Network. Um, how do you know whether you have that capacity or whether your phone can do that? If you go to your settings, to Google settings, you go to all settings, you go to find mine and then you will see option for offline uh, device uh, track location if it is not in your phone then there are two things involved it could be that your country has not received the release or your device is not compatible so go right now go check whether it's compatible with your own phone the next thing there is the OEM will determine how the offline work there are some devices that could be offline and be able to track for some few minutes or hours or days or weeks there are some devices that won't be able to track you know long when they are off and it also depends on other devices within that area so if there is much traffic of devices within that area it is easier to find your device and to track uh so finally finally it is really now the services will come for older devices with google play services update of course many of you don't even know google play services automatically updates itself on the background so you might just want to check or refresh and then you see that you have that service uh, it's also available for every android 15 out of the box uh, to have that and also it is uh, something that will roll out from country to country so google is not saying anything about the list it's not saying anything about the number of compatible devices and i don't blame them because of the wide range and strata within android but also it is extending to other devices like earbuds tags it's extended to bluetooth you have to watch out for the tag uh, compatible with find my on android and if that is on your device you can also find it on your new find my <laughs> network on google so let me hear from you in the comment section are you really really excited about this the way i am <laughs> let me hear from you in the comment section and until i see you in the next one it is peace